Um, when a person gets married, their primary is their spouse. Is that clear? Mm -hmm. That's the primary relationship. Because without that foundation, the structure of the family isn't going to be secure and the children will not have a secure, stable, um, executive functioning team to rely upon. So it's really, really important that your husband make you number one and that mm -hmm. you make him number one. So really the issue is going to be primarily between you and he and everything happening around uh, the, the us, the we circle, is really for you guys to communicate about. Yes. I think the worst thing that you could do is try to communicate directly with your mother-in-law because you're already the foreign object, all right? So mm -hmm. that's not going to work. And the second yep. thing to, to realize is that there, there were dynamics before uh, you guys got married. We have mm -hmm. to understand the fa family dynamics. So if, for example, mother and son were enmeshed. So this is why yeah. this is happening is because there was an unhealthy enmeshment going on between son and mother. And, and, and so he wants to, in his mind, maintain the golden child position. He doesn't want to hurt his mom because she, he sees her as weak. And so therefore, you're going to sense a, a great deal of uh, a be you know betrayal like why is he yeah. supporting his mother and so these are the kinds of things that you want to discuss with your husband is you want to have a peaceful healing dialogue with him